In this video, we're going to show you just how easy it is to install the third generation Mr. Cool DIY Duckless Mini Split. Once you've found the right spot in your space to install the mini split, use the included wall template to measure where you would like to place your indoor air handler. The mounting plate is located on the back of the air handler. Detach the mounting plate with a drill or screwdriver, then line up the plate with the markings you've made on the wall. As you're securing the mounting plate to the wall, set a level on top of the mounting plate to make sure the plate doesn't slope. Once the mounting plate is secure, use a three and a half inch hole saw to drill through your wall. Push the provided wall sleeve through the wall and note how far it sticks out on the other side. You will want it to be as close to flush as possible. You can use a saw or knife to cut the wall sleeve as needed. Slowly bend the piping until it is sticking straight out from the back of the air handler. Now take the air handler's communication wire and feed it through the wall sleeve to the outside. Take the refrigerant lines, the drain hose, and the rest of the communication wire and push it through the wall sleeve. Then connect the air handler to the wall bracket. The top of the air handler should hook onto the top of the wall bracket, then snap into place at the bottom. Don't forget to set the wall sleeve cover in place before the next step. Outside, slowly bend the refrigerant lines so the lines fall downward along the wall. Add the protective neoprene inside the wall sleeve and around the line set. Once the air handler is secure, uncoil the line set that came with the condenser. Unscrew the color-coded caps on the ends of your refrigerant lines and thread them together by hand. Then use two wrenches to make sure they are secured tightly. Then do the same thing with the refrigerant lines at the condenser. Once the refrigerant lines are secure, remove the valve covers on the condenser. Then use the provided Allen wrench to open the valves. Turn the wrench counterclockwise until it stops. Make sure you don't force it. Replace the valve covers. Use soapy water at both the condenser and air handler refrigerant connections to check for leaks. Wrap the refrigerant connections near the air handler with sound deadening pads. Then connect the condensate drain hose securely. For the sleekest look, be sure to get the Mr. Cool line guard to cover the refrigerant lines, condensate hose, and communication wire. With the Mr. Cool DIY Duckless Mini Split 3rd Generation, we've made it easier than ever to install heating and cooling wherever you need it. For more information on these units or any accessories that come with them, visit MrCool.com. <laughs>